should you use holiday decor in the background of your videos? There are times when you should and times when you shouldn't. If your video is holiday specific, so if you're doing something related to Christmas or Valentine's Day or whatever it happens to be, absolutely you can use that holiday decor behind you. If, however, your content is more evergreen, if it's something you want to reuse later on, do not use holiday content. This is going to hurt you. Because if you want to be able to use that piece of content that you filmed in December around Christmas time, but it has Christmas trees and garland and all the things in the background, and you're trying to use it in June or July or August, that just doesn't make sense. People are going to know that it's dated. You did not film it right now. This is an old piece of content. And the algorithms actively look for things in the background. They know when there's Christmas trees. They know when there's hearts for Valentine's Day. They know the things. And they're more likely to send that piece of content out around the holidays than on an evergreen basis because it just doesn't make sense to be showing Christmas in the middle of March. So you have to be aware of how you're going to reuse and repurpose this. If it's, again, holiday specific, go for it. That is going to help your standing. But if it's evergreen content or if it's content not specific to a holiday, don't do it. So then what do you do? I'm somebody who loves to decorate. I love my decor. In fact, right now, my house is decorated. We are in the middle of a season. We are heading into holidays, and I'm so excited for it. But I'm in an area where you can't tell that everything else is decorated. Seriously, there's there's decorations everywhere. But I'm sitting at my kitchen table in a corner. I'm literally, you can see right there, that's the corner. I'm right next to a big glass window, I've or the sliding glass doors. I got a big glass window over there. My puppies are over in the living room. There's decor everywhere. But because I'm in a corner, you can see I just have a basic background. I've got my little plant here. I've got my lights behind me. I've made it so that it is simple and easy for me to reuse this content later on because even though right now I'm talking about holidays, I'm not talking about a specific holiday. I'm not just talking about Christmas or just talking about Valentine's Day or just talking about St. Patrick's Day. I'm not just talking about New Year's Eve. I'm talking about all the holidays and I'm talking about content creation. So I do not want the algorithms to think, oh, I can only show this during Christmas. Oh, this is only pertaining to Christmas. Oh, this is only pertaining to whatever. Even though I'm saying the words, it's hearing that I'm talking about all the different things. It's hearing that I'm having an evergreen conversation, not necessarily just a holiday specific thing. And my background is not specific to one thing. If people are watching content in March, in April, in May, and they're scrolling through and seeing Christmas trees, are they going to stop for that content? No, because it's old and it's dated and it's not relevant to right now. But having a space like this that's dedicated to just my background, just the conversation that I'm having, that allows me to have the conversations without my decor hindering me. But again, I literally have the decorations everywhere else. I'm, I'm transitioning between the two different times. So I've got a lot of things out everywhere. So you have the option of having your decorations up and taking them down for your video and putting them back up or creating a dedicated space just like this corner. This literally is like the length of my arms here, okay? You can see I don't even have to expand my arms. Other than that, I've got decor everywhere. This is just my little corner. So it doesn't look out of place with the rest of the things that I'm doing. It just looks like it's the corner of the house where I did not put up a Christmas tree because there's no room between where the chairs are and the wall, right? This is my wall. This is my table right here. You can kind of, well, right there. This is my table. So there's no space to put decor here. It doesn't look out of place, but I can still use it to create that evergreen content. So if it's holiday specific, by all means, get your decorations in there. It will only help you to get people's attention, to stop the scroll, and to get the algorithm to place you properly. But if you are doing evergreen content that is not holiday specific, make sure that you have your normal background, whatever that happens to be, or you have a dedicated space where you can just set up in a little corner just like this to create that content without disturbing the rest of the things that you are doing. Of course, everything is up to you. You can create your content the way you need to, but holiday specific things, do better with holiday specific backgrounds and non-holiday specific things do not perform well with holiday backgrounds. So just keep that in mind as you're making up your decisions for how you're creating your content. Drop your questions down below and follow along as we continue to help you navigate the world of your social media marketing to make this your most profitable year ever with less stress and overwhelm because your business is working on your behalf without you having to be hands-on every minute of every day so you can live your best life and do the best you can for your business. We'll see you in the upcoming episodes.